Hi and welcome to this tutorial. Like you can see, I'm in the back end of Joomla. If you are using the back end of Joomla, sometimes you need to go to the file manager to upload something or to just work on your website because it's just easier to use the file manager. To do this, most users, for example, go to cPanel or they go to FileZilla or an F FTP. But it's also possible to use the file manager from the backend of Joomla. Like you can see, I click components here and I click ext explorer here, explorer. Explore, and then I wait, and then you see a file manager, and then you go. You can just explore your website if you want to go to your templates, for example. Here we got GS Smart. If you want to see the images or anything, you can just go in and check anything in your website with uh, explore and if you're done just uh, you can just uh, go to the back to Joomla the good part is that you actually can upload or create copy or you can move things you can rename things you can click on new, you can make a new file or a new map. Like you can see, you can just use it as a normal file extension. You can change the rights, you can watch it, you can download the file or you can upload the file in the right directory. And then you click save and it's on your server. So it's so much easier than just going to your cPanel or to your file manager if you can just go to the backend and use your own explorer here. Explorer can be found here in the Joomla extensions directory. This is the Joomla Explorer extension. And if you click on get this, it's a totally free extension for Joomla 2.5 and 3. You can, here, can download it here. This is the latest version, so you download it. And if you have downloaded it, you go, go to extensions, extension manager. And you go to upload packets file, you click choose file. And it's automatically already opening in the download section of my website or my computer, I mean the desktop. And then I see, come ex here's the Explorer extension. I click open. And then I click upload and install. And Explorer is installed on the Joomla side. That's how you install it. So I hope you like this tutorial. And I hope you will be back to my channel soon to watch more of my tutorials.